up guys boogie fitness boogie the trainer back again and in this video i'm gonna show you everything i buy when i start my weight loss journey i know so many people struggle to find out the foods they need to buy the kind of foods to get good fats to get good protein to get good 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 carbohydrates and uh, so I decided to make this video. I just went shopping. Now I was gonna go shopping. I was gonna take you guys shopping with me, but you know, so many people, so much noise. I decided to buy everything. And then I just show you everything I bought and why I bought what I bought. Okay? All right. You guys need to understand one thing. When you start your fat loss journey, it takes planning. It's one thing to make up your mind that you want to lose some weight, you want to lose some fat, or you want to get back in the gym. And it's another thing to actually plan the whole thing out. Okay, right now I know when I'm going to be working out, what days I'm going to be working out, uh, which kind of workouts I'm going to be doing. I know how many days of cardio I'm going to be doing. I know how many minutes of cardio I'm going to be doing, how many calories I'm looking to burn when I start, you know, uh, working out. The thing most people fail to do is plan. And if you don't plan ahead of time, you plan to fail. So everything I bought, I literally had to write down everything I bought and why I'm buying everything I bought. Okay, I already know my macros. Uh, I know what I'm going to be eating in the morning, in the evening, and uh, pre-workout, after the gym, snacks, and everything of that sort. Okay? So... Everything I bought, I make the plan first. And then I go to the to this grocery store. I usually go to Walmart and buy everything. So I plan the foods I'm going to eat, when I'm going to be eating, how much I'm going to be eating. That way when I go to buy, I know exactly what I'm buying. Okay? So I'm going to show you my meal plan and then I'm going to show you everything I bought. All right? All right. So as you guys you guys can see, I made my meal plan, you see that, uh, pre-workout, two pairs, post-workout, lunch, snacks, dinner, I know exactly what I'm going to be eating, there's rice right there, oatmeal, fruits, peanut butter, two slices of bread, and everything. So the first thing you always should do is to write down everything you need to eat when you're going to be eating so you are ready ahead of time. So on my meal plan, I had rice. Now, this is pre-packaged rice, which means I can easily put this, oh well, pre-cooked. Pre so which means I can easily put this in the microwave and then for 90, minute, 90 seconds, let me just, uh, okay, so for 90 seconds in the, in, the, in the microwave to be ready, right? And then obviously water, so the, I bought more water. So guys, I'm just showing you just a few things I bought. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't have enough room to show you everything I bought on this table. So I bought three of these. Now, as you see, you guys on my meal plan, I have bread, but now I buy the whole grain bread, guys. Whole grain bread, not white bread. Whole grain. Why whole grain? Because whole grain bread has fiber see that right there fiber now the fiber helps with keeping you full and helps with your digestive system and then this is my go-to in the morning usually after I work out oatmeal oatmeal is a, a staple for my uh, fat loss journey why oatmeal because oatmeal is better than regular cereal just having a cup of oatmeal is gonna give you see right there 20 it's gonna give you it's gonna be 50 50 54 grams of carbohydrates just one cup and i usually don't eat more than one cup because one cup is gonna full, fill me up so much and remember oatmeal is all full of fiber too which is gonna keep you full for at least two and a half hours okay the point of of knowing what you're gonna eat and buying the right kind of foods is to keep you full most people don't eat all the time because they eat the wrong kind of foods 
if you get if you eat the wrong kind of foods you are going to constantly feel hungry and you feel feel hungry and you keep eating the wrong type wrong type of foods you are going to run the risk of being way too over your caloric intake okay now with oatmeal i like to eat on my oatmeal with whey protein now this is gaf whey protein shout out to chris jones and this is scoop so you can use, some people use this protein to as a protein shake but i like to use this for my to mix it with my uh, oatmeal in the morning after i work out you know to keep me it really it tastes good as you you guys can see i have carbohydrate sauces bread rice oatmeal and then i have protein sources which is whey protein powder peanut butter i'm going to talk more about this and then chicken these are drumsticks i bought drumsticks because i just season them put them in the in the oven bake them for you know 30 40 minutes and i'm good to go good protein source also guys don't forget fruits fruits are a good snack but i also eat these before i go to the gym i can eat like two pairs just to give me that energy push for the gym and then for fats i like to go for with with natural peanut butter you know some people think fats are bad but you need fats for your joints okay you need fats for your joints and for your overall health the point is to have healthy fats and to have them in moderation most gyms are opening up around the world so guys let's kill it comment down below like the video subscribe to this channel if you found this video very helpful all right and i'll get you guys back next time peace